federal prosecutors and attorneys for Border Patrol agent Lonnie Swartz met again today in the courtroom. Swartz is responsible for shooting and killing a Mexican teen. Nine Year Science Ivan Rodriguez attended the hearing where Swartz's attorney made their case to move the trial to Phoenix. In 2012, Border Patrol agent Lonnie Swartz shot and killed 16-year-old Jose Antonio Elena Rodriguez. Earlier this year, a jury found Swartz not guilty of second-degree murder, but could not decide on less serious manslaughter charges, something the prosecution is retrying in this case. And that he was gunned down in cold blood. There was no justification for him being killed that night. And there's got to be a better job done by the Department of Justice this time to show that it was completely unjustified. The Border Patrol Union says Swartz was only doing his job. At this point, uh, it truly sees that, you know, the people that are protesting, the people that are attacking, the signs, calling Border Patrol agents murderers, it's nothing more than a witch hunt. Before even beginning, Swartz's attorneys motioned to move the trial to Phoenix. They say over the last five years, media coverage in southern Arizona has made it improbable to find a fair and balanced jury. They also mentioned Bishop Weisenberger's message after the first trial when he said the jury's decision raised serious issues of justice and accountability. During today's hearing, the judge said the defense attorney's motion to move the trial location was premature. He suggested waiting until they go through jury questionnaires, but left the door open for the defense to bring up the motion to move the trial again at a later time. Ivan Rodriguez, KGUN 9, on your side.